very early today. I'm kind of just walking in basically. So, what, what exactly are we going to do? So, we're going to try to learn how to use this very cool machine. Yeah, I should that. put this on. So, this uh, machine is able to, sorry, I'm going to put it on backwards. Yeah, this, the small part is... Uh, yeah. Yeah, you can start over again if you like. <laughs> so basically what we are doing today is trying to learn how to use this uh, machine called the Humac Norm, yeah. which is a, what is called a dynamometer. What it can do is very accurately uh, measure the amount of torque and the range of motion in very specific movements. So it, it has all these attachments that force you into uh, certain positions and then you can only move within a certain range and that's how it uh, is able to be very accurate. Yeah. And the one who's gonna help us uh, yeah. learn so all about this is Alicia. Hi Alicia. <laughs> Welcome to the Human Performance Lab. We're gonna learn a little bit more about how to uh, track arm wrestling um, using motion capture and our force uh, dynamometer um, right. and it's kind of cool and I'm a little bit excited because I think this is the perfect lab for something like this and yeah. we might have to invent a handle or something we might not have the piece <laughs> that we need but that's okay that's what research is all about um, so today we're going to learn that's what we're gonna yeah do. that's that's awesome all right this is what happens when you ask for science <laughs> So again, the people are here will have this all the time. Oh, yeah. All the rest of the pieces will be out of the way. But you're welcome to the beginning. All right, it's your slide. So, slide? Oh. How are we? What's I feel like I could get the... The other way is easier? Yeah. Okay. No, no, it's not It's or not it's easier. Just, just I go on my hands. So, personally then, let them sit on the chair and then slide this in. Yeah, probably. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. Nope. So, Forearm same, again. Same as before. Okay. This now. So last so, time so, we did this. Yeah. So. Sorry. Now we're doing this. So pronation. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Super, okay. and together. Yeah. Super and pro. Yes. All right. So we will adjust heights and everything, but really this is again what we're kind of looking for. All right. All right, my main man. Here you go. So, right, so things we can do. We can move you closer. We can move you farther. We I can. Feel like I want to move closer. Yeah. Definitely so, since you're back in. And oh, and also this, are you able to move this? Yeah, closer? we're going to bring you closer. So I would say this distance is going to represent more thigh length. Yeah. And this, to me, is as long as the person is comfy, we'll let you try it without the arm uh, seatbelt on, and you can see if you like it or don't like it, okay? Yeah. All right, so we feel good this way. You're, as long as their knees are on the back of this, I would let them tell you how good that feels against their back. Okay. Um, and again, as long as when you relax back, your shoulders come back, yeah. you would be good as well. Um, so yeah, so wait forward, chair forward up and seat forward up and back forward up. Now we probably could move him completely backwards a bit to get your hand underneath the... Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then this is probably, this is the height it's supposed to be. So this is the one that has to move. Yeah, I'll hold it for you so it doesn't drop on. And probably just a little bit, eh? Yeah, just, just a just little. little. Yeah. About there? Oh uh, yeah, that's good. Okay. Okay, and does it feel like this angle feels good this way or do you want it the other way? So, so here's our question. Yeah. This or put that back. That felt good there. Mm. Alright, so here's our question. Oh yeah. Well yeah. oh, actually I like this better. Yeah, this is this, better? Yeah, but I need this. Okay, we this. can move it higher now, yeah. but you like that position better? Yeah, I, I, I love this one better. Okay, and we want and this hand better. Yeah, okay. 
uh, low, lower. Lower? His hand lower if yeah. you want to put his hand more on the grip. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's it. That's this it. Is this is how I work out. Look at the show. smile yeah. on his face. Yeah. 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 Perfect. All right. So that feels good. Feels good in here. Yeah. All right. And he's got his grip. I'm going to tighten these up on you for sure. All right. Hopefully this works now. Hopefully this works. All right. So we did those. We got those. We can hit OK. It's right. gonna it's gonna measure uh, the right? twisting. Yeah. I'm hoping it is. It's it's a little wonky right now. I'm, I might have to call the guy, but we're gonna set you up anyway so yeah. that we can. See, we're gonna see if it works. Yeah. Uh, twist left and right. Okay. Twist left and then twist right. This is already like back. heavy. Yeah. yeah, and then come back the other way. Okay. Let's see if it'll work. I think, okay. Yeah, talk uh, to me. Just uh, if it was a little bit more this way, uh, are you able to move it this way a little bit? Move you this way. No, th this, this thing. Uh, oh, yes, we can make this one. Yeah, yeah. So one. I feel like if, yeah. Yeah, I, I can kind of have, I have more torque. That, that feels, feels better? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, that's an easy one to fix for sure, mm -hmm. right? Okay, so then when he says that, you just hit clear again. And again, we're leaving a little bit extra so it counts our reps, because now we know how hard it was. Mm -hmm. uh, all right, so tracking you, go ahead. One one way, the other. And again, you could give them numbers. You say, I only want this person to move from this to this. Mm -hmm. All right, you ready? Yeah. Let's see what happens here. I'm perfect. All right, so these again are going to 113 was our position of our angle. So that's in here, 113 degrees in here. But again, um, right, this is, uh, oh, oh, probably I flip it all the way around. Yeah, so what's opposite of 113? Yeah, one. Now it's 113. Okay, perfect. Uh, yeah, that was right because your thumb was against yeah, it. And yeah. You like that? Perfect. Perfect. So it's like so. Yeah. So, so now sit okay. down and go. In you get. Yeah. That'll be a full set. All the way for one. You didn't go all the way. There's one. Yes, it counted. One. Yeah. Go. All the way up. Yes. All the way down. There's two. You got three to go. All the way up. All the way down. Hang on. All the way up. All the way down. <laughs> one more time, one more time. All the way up. Yes. Okay. Good job. Good job. Ooh, let your hand relax. I'm going to let this open for you. you can... So the torque number, what does the 20 represent? Tw uh, torque. Um, uh, new, new meters per second. Okay. Yeah. You had to ask us what torque stood for. I'm right? like, yeah. what math is that? Yeah. <laughs> Which one is that? That's an this M. This is very measurable, so it's really cool. Yeah. 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 Okay. No, it gives you an exact measure of. Um, yes, and yeah. we'll make sure that we have dummy proof instructions so that we know exactly what numbers to put in and then we'll highlight which ones you adjust slightly to the person. Yeah. Um, so then that there's nothing and I will make sure that this glitch is gone so that this does not happen because it really is embarrassing. I had, well, no, I had it happen on two clients. Well, I know, but when you have someone lying down on their foot and then you got to yeah. take them all out, you're like, oh, sorry. How much did you get for... I, I haven't looked. Oh! Probably beat me. So, probably. yes. So, what else we can do is we can print them out right away. Okay. So, people could walk away with it if you want to say, yeah, you can walk away with a printout uh -huh. if that's what you would like to give your participants. Because, again, you can give them a fake name. Mm -hmm. um, right? You don't have to put their real name in there. Yeah. Um, and they can come out with their printout. Clearly, you would get your printouts, but you get the graphs. So, if you did left and right, they will put the graph left and right beside each other. Mm -hmm. So each graph will match. You're getting, in this one, you get uh, torque versus time. And I believe you get um, a, a chart of torques of like different types of averages, peak averages, mm -hmm. uh, prominence, widths, things like that. Um, so a little bit more on the geek side. 